Call me Neoblade. This is the last video for the staircase step two. We'll see Showtech again and this game is SQ101 and we will see a game afterwards using the staircase step 3 with SQ50 the same player Showtech the same month playing it and I want to show you why it's so important to train the multitasking trainers and to really train getting an SQ above 90 or 100. He's taking a far third. I like that. Again, Showtech is a better Zerg player than myself, but I beat him regularly on a regular basis with Terran and Protoss. He, he sometimes wins, sometimes I win. He should take the Watchtowers. Should build some spine crawlers. He's keeping his money low. He's taking the watchtowers. The opponent micros like hell, but he gets overmans like hell too. Macro hatches, very good, very nice. Manyard slide. Mineral field. Anti drones. Very good. We have seen. I pause here. We have seen games by Showtech where he never surpasses 50 drones, and where he have 48 drones at the 8 minute mark, 9 minute mark, 10 minute mark, and so on. Mineral this is field. the right way Deplete. to do to do it. Should scout definitely down there. What what is there? Hidden base? No. Mineral field depleted. He should build a fourth base. uses all of his links and he should reclaim the watchtowers. He thought like me that there is another base but he should have scouted it with one link not a hundred <laughs> or a hundred sixty. He's getting now his other bases our forces are under attack. Uh, Venture Fortress is a bad thing. But since the opponent only has three bases, he should in instantly, instantly uh, kill it again. His creep spread is pretty decent for a Silver League player. Mineral I think field there is. He, did, he does not need a macro hatch now because um, there is enough lava on the field. Again, Using the staircase Mineral means you want to depleted. have zero lava, and this now is not a planetary fortress, 
and so this base will die again. I like that that very much. He um, he, he pr spreads creep instead of looking at his um, at his army. But I think this hatchery is not keyed here because it has. Now it's keyed. Okay. But there was a lot of lava, and again, forty-seven lava. Okay, it means he has a lot of cr uh, bases and he uh, injects all the time so he can keep uh, keep his money low. Creep spread is reaching the opponent's base, which is very good. And now go kill him. The opponent has counter units to slow links. He's trying to repair, but the links will start killing the SCVs, and even if the opponent survives, he does not have income anymore. This is a beautiful, a beautiful example how the staircase can work. And you see the difference between my games and the games powered by Showtech. And Showtech is by all, by no means a Grandmaster player. No, you want to. And now if something happen, he will shoot down his own. He will shoot down his own. Um, Depots, and you see it here. The tank is gone. The queens killed all the Vikings. The opponent has better upgrades, but he has no income. And Showtech again. Building drones is your main problem. You do, you want to be on 50 drones, 60 drones all the time. When you take gas, it have, has to be more than uh, 70 drones. But he stays calm, which is very good. Now he takes his queens. You should creep spread there, yeah, of course, it's nice. You should just go kill him in the main base. You could fly overlords all of the all over the bases. These overlords could guard other bases because he cannot build that much of an army right now. Mineral field depleted. Our forces Your main problem attack. sometimes I think is show Mineral tech field. that you try to win. You don't do you do not try to improve, which is the major point. When it comes to the staircase, try not to win, try to improve. And thirty five drones at twenty attack. minutes is it is it is wrong, it is bad. Just for your information, you could build a spore crawler here, and then you would see the widow mines, or um, spread your creep and build a spore crawler here and a spore crawler here. But it's enough, even against widow mines. 
this game is over. And we still see a lot of room for improvement. Oh, it's a fake GG. Not nice. I will Base take a short look what the opponent is doing. 2,000 minutes. SCVs are under attack. Okay. I want to see this one. Showtech scouted the space. A false GG. You have always have to be prepared for things like that. Yeah, he scouted the base, and then it's GG. Nice game. One of the finest games for the staircase step 2 I've ever seen. Because the opponent bunkered, the opponent placed Widow Mines, and he still did not had a chance to win the game. But again, 32 drones at 22 minutes. Very bad, Showtech. Very, very, very bad. It's not important to win the game. It's important you get a 60 to a 17 drones and you are on three base saturation all the time. You you miss this point totally. Drone timing is it, it's difficult, I know, but you miss the point of playing Zerg. You need drones. You just need the frigging drones. Thank you guys. Please subscribe to my channel. Showtech, no hard feelings. You know I really like your games. It's the best, the best Zerg the staircase game I've ever seen from a novice player. Mamba, of course, is in a higher dimension. He's not not in this world, he's not in this universe. So this is this is a real game guys and you should aim you should set your goal to playing like Showtech and then you should aim to play like Mamba and do not make the same mistakes Showtech did so please enjoy the staircase have fun and I see you please subscribe to my channel and I see you guys next time Call me Neoblade. I apologize. I forgot that I wanted to um, show two replays. This is SQ50, which is a big difference to SQ101. So We'll see how how it goes. And the opponent is building cannons again. Okay, we see two spine crawlers. I don't know why. But Showtech has sometimes a strange way of building static defense. Remember the time where he built a spore crawler in his mineral line at two minutes? At four minutes the most fast DTs can arrive. Mark Ratches I like very much. And I think he will kill the gold base now. Again, I apologize not putting these videos together instantly, but I hope you will forgive me.
killing this base is the right choice. It's totally right. But afterwards, droning. Droning, 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 droning. And one of the m major mistakes I want to show you. Resources. Seen below here. I checked the video again. Yes. You should never get more than 200 gas. Or if you're, it's the first try in the staircase step 3, never get more than 400. But 600 gas, bad. Because the structures, we have link speed, but we do not have an evo chamber. So where's the lair? Where's the evo chamber? Where is something that uses gas? He's not allowed to use banelings. He's not allowed to build mutas. So he needs upgrades. He needs hive tech for cracklings. He could build three evo chambers to upgrade his queens as well. This opponent is really bad. This creep spread was better. The queen is running to the opponent's base. If behind Dark Shrine. And now we're getting drones. This is very good. There's the evil chamber. Again, it's not enough. There are the DTs. You should kill the spawn crawlers. And he's still mining gas, even if it's not much. And now he stopped mining gas. Static defense. You're allowed for a layer if you want to take that much gas. So you could build an overseer, but you want to drop. I think this will be quite a surprise for our opponent. This is the staircase step 3 and you're totally allowed to drop your opponent, but you see Let's just show this for a minute. We are in Legacy of the Void. We are at 10 minutes and 40 seconds. Shotek has 23 drones. He's not building any because he's so focused on dropping. Drop is totally fine. Train your multitasking. But build drones. If you use overlords to drop, build drones. Build static defense. Workers killed 26. So, again, he was not above 50 workers. My beloved Showtech, please build drones. Watch all the videos regarding drone timing, my German video, or search for day 9 drone timing. It's important. No drones, just links. No lair for overseers. No lair for creep puking. Two prong attack, very nice. I think 
Yeah. We would need an overseer. Mineral field depleted. Mineral field and I think depleted. the opponent will die now. But again, you see, this game is not nearly as good as step two. Showtech will win. Showtech did use Overlord drop, right. But the creep spread is not even near the opponent's base. And Ruins of Seras is a bigger map. And the creep spread went into the base of the Terran. And no drones again. Drones again. I think you should build drones again. <sighs> Focusing on the attack. We still, still could build a lair with 500 gas. We still could build an overseer with 500 gas. We are in step 3 and we are allowed to build a lair and an overseer. Depleted. I like this game, but I think the game against the Terran was way better. This is my humble opinion, but I think the SQ was way better and of course the Protoss was killed by the drop, but finishing a game with 23 drones and this base is existing forever and no mining from these mineral patches. Situation situation yeah you can play better show tech I'm I'm convinced of this fact that you can play better like that the creep never went any further on the other map I bet if you would have creeped as good as then you would the creep would at least be here or here. Thank you guys, thank you Showtech for your replays and I hope you guys enjoy my videos. Showtech I hope you learn something viewing these videos and please subscribe to my channel and I see you guys in the next video.